tackled now for the lead by Meta Horse. Meta Horse wins nicely. He was bought in the breeze ups this spring. Ammo and Omni Horse decided to buy him and luckily send him to me. A lot of horses, when they go to the breeze ups, they come into trainers and they're really revved. This horse from day one was super chilled and he's been very easy to train. He's a Nirvana Grey horse out of a Caddo Genro mare. Nirvana Grey is a sire who's doing really, really well as first season sire. His dam actually was unraced, but she'd bred three winners. He's very competitive. Ross Arena length or so down aboard Meta Horse. And a will to win, which seems to be a trait that the sire is passing on. Made his debut at Chester. Chester's a very turning track. It's one of the oldest race courses in the UK. Then he went back to Chester. The jockey rode him very well. He sat off the pace and he came through and he won three lengths very easily. I always say with a horse, you've got to ride the race as you find it. He's not a confirmed front runner. Like the other day when he won, they went flat out. He was slightly off the bridle. He's not too ground dependent. I wouldn't want to run him on very firm or very soft. He's a very giving, easy horse to deal with. When you're getting a horse to fitness, you have to do more work with them. Once they're fit, it's a question of keeping their minds right, keeping their heads in the mangers and keeping them sound and happy. He'll probably have two or three more runs this year. He potentially could be a horse that could line up in the Britannia at Royal Ascot next year. He's got a very good personality, a very good mind. He's an easy ride. All the staff love riding him. He's very uncomplicated. Training made simple.